I think I lost my camera feed here. If there is anything which is a pain in the butt, there's a teething puppy which is cutting its teeth and everything it's not supposed to. Including your fingers and your toes and your shoes and your purse and the kids' toes and, you know, your furniture, upholstery, table legs. Having a raw bone gives them something to do. It wears them out. It keeps them busy when you're leaving and you're dealing with separation anxiety, like crying and fussing and howling and carrying on, like, you know, you murdering them or something like this, which a lot of puppies have that number down really quick. It helps with the teething also when they are old enough to cut their baby teeth. Yes, puppies have baby teeth and they will shed the baby teeth when they are about mm, roughly between three and a half to five months. It depends on the breed, it depends on the individual puppy. It also depends on what you feed. If they have something where they can healthily cut their teeth on, you don't deal with retained baby teeth, which have to be removed surgically, usually when the puppy gets spayed or neutered. Um, most of those will come out when they have the proper tools to work on, meaning something to chew on, which is fun to chew on, and which they can uh, naturally work out those teeth. The other thing is it makes them tired. No, leave her, she got your own. It makes them tired. A tired puppy is a good puppy. <laughs> Ask me how I know because when you have a puppy which is mentally and physically challenged, you have a happy puppy. It's not coming up with stupid stuff to do. When these guys here are done eating, they lay down and they'll go sleep for an hour or two. Just like that, you know. They, and look at them, there's two of them. There's no fighting going on. Uh, there's no stealing. Well, sometimes there is when I'm not paying attention. But the little one kind of takes care of her own self. And when we are done, or rather when they are done, I will show you what's left over. Talk to you in a bit.